Hello and welcome to my channel. This is Mary, the farm girl. Today we are looking at the temporary foreign worker jobs in Canada at the Canada Job Bank website. I will talk about uh, how you can apply for these jobs and what you need to complete the application process. So stick around for that. I know you value your success, therefore kindly subscribe and join us in this career growth journey. So let's jump into the website and see what jobs are currently on offer today. So first of all, we are going to look at the jobs that do not require you to have a work permit because they are easier to navigate. This means that anybody with or without a work permit can be able to apply. The first job on the list is a general farm worker. It is a job by Mon Monoway Farms Limited. It was posted on March 20th, 2022. So it has been there for at least a month because including uh, April. But you can still try because the two vacancies are still available. So the job requires you to have English proficiency. You should be having a high school graduation certificate. You should have less than seven months of experience. The specific skills that you are going to be having are tend to animals, clean stables, barns, barnyards, and pens. You should also be able to write a basic progress report and monitor animal health. The equipment you're going to be operating on is a tractor. The job is located in the rural areas of Canada. You are also going to be given a housing option, so you don't need to worry about accommodation. The employer is requiring application from Canadian residents and permanent uh, residents, but also the foreign workers can also apply for this job with or without a valid work permit. The second job on the list is a farm general worker. It was posted on 4th, 2022 of April last month. It was posted by Ellie Farms and Equestrian Club Incorporation. The job is going to offer you $15 per hour, 40 hours per week. They have nine vacancies for the job and the job is verified. The English language proficiency, you don't need any degree certificate or diploma, but you must have seven months of experience. The works that you're going to be working on are you spray or dust plants with insecticides and fungicides. You'll plant, cultivate and irrigate crops, operate and maintain farm machinery and equipment. You harvest the crops, you feed and tend to animals, you fertilize and spray crops, you detect diseases and health problems in crops livestock and poultry you examine the produce and quality to prepare for the market you set and monitor water lines this is for the irrigation airflow and temperature in pans pens and chicken coops you write daily basic progress reports you organize and coordinate planting cultivating and crop harvesting activities you raise and you breed livestock and poultry and you monitor their health you should be willing to relocate to canada the job is available for both canadian uh, residents and if you are a foreign resident or a foreign worker you can be able to apply for this job you do not need a work permit for this job the third job that you do not want, need a work permit for is a farm equipment operator it is located in uh, brussels ontario uh, they are offering the job uh, for $16 to $22 per hour, 50 hours per week. If you are given this job, you will be a permanent. You will be permanently employed. So it is a full-time job. There are three vacancies and you're going to get health benefits and long-term benefits, insurance benefits and financial benefit. English language is the major language that you need for this job. You don't need to have any degree, certificate or diploma, but you must have seven months of experience. The special skills are to plant, cultivate, irrigate, operate and maintain the farm machinery and equipment. And you should also be able to harvest crops. These are skills that you can actually say you have if you have operated on uh, uh, tractors, tillage equipment, planting equipment, manure spreader, or harvesters before the job is located in the rural areas of canada and by the way they are offering staff accommodation so these are the health benefits you will be if you are having any disabilities 
you can be able to apply for this job. They are going to give you dental plan and paramedical services coverage. They are also going to give you financial benefits and as a bonus apart from the hourly rate of the wages. The employer does not require you to have a work permit for those uh, foreign workers. And remember, it is a permanent uh, job, so you can be able to relocate to Canada permanently. So those are the three jobs that you do not require to have a work permit for. Now let us look at the jobs that you need to have a work permit before you apply. Well, the first one is the tractor operator. The firm is called B&S Kravitz Farm Limited. They are going to offer you the job for 19 to 20 dollars uh, for 60 hours per week. It is a seasonal employment, so it is a part-time leading to full-time. If you work well, you're going to be employed full-time. This job was posted on the Job Bank website on 19th of April 2022, and it is having one vacancy let us look at the requirements you need to have english proficiency you don't need to have any degree certificate or diploma you have to, you must have seven months of experience you should be able to operate and maintain farm machinery and equipment the equipment including tractor and planting equipment the crops are cucumbers bell peppers and melons and you're going to be operating from a rural area so the work location is in a rural area. However, they need you to have a work permit. So if you do not have a work permit as a foreign worker, please do not apply for this job because the employer says they are not going to respond to your application. The second job that requires you to have a work permit is a on operator or farm machinery. It is located in Ontario, Curran, and the company is leon delmo limited you can start as soon as possible it is just one vacancy and the job uh, employer is verified the languages you can be either speaking in french or english you don't need any educational certificates for this job however you must have seven months or to less than a year of experience the specific skills you're going to be operating farm machinery and equipment and harvesting crops you will be operating with a vegetable harvester tractor loader and farm truck the types of crops are potatoes and vegetables it is located in a rural area they are going to give you housing options so you don't need to have to worry about accommodation the job is available for canadian residents and those foreign workers with a valid canadian work permit the third job on the list is a farm worker. This is a crop farmer by Bill and Stanley Oyster Company. So this is a mushroom company. They are offering the job for $16 to $17 hour, an hour for 40 uh, to 55 hours per week. They have 10 good vacancies, 10 vacancies, my friends. So you can apply for this job. And apparently this job was posted on 19th of April 2022. So it is a recent job, given that today is on the 2nd of May 2022. The requirements, you need to have English, education, high school graduation certificate, or an equivalent of the same. You should be having experience for seven months to less than a year. The specific skills, you should be able to plant, cultivate, and irrigate crops, operate and maintain the farm machinery and equipment, Harvest the crops, feed and tend to animals, fertilize and spray crops, examine produce and, uh, for quality and prepare for the market. You should be able to do hard harvesting vegetables and vegetable culling. These machinery are going to be used for harvesting the vegetables and planting them. Additional area of specialization is cattle breeding. The job is located in an urban area and they are going to provide you with accommodation. A work permit for this job if you don't have a work permit they might not be able to respond to your application another job posted on the website on 22nd of april last month 2022 is a farm laborer it was posted by spa brothers farm limited and they are located in uh, 144 bridge street 
they are offering the job for 13.335 hours i mean dollars per hour for 40 to 60 hours per week you know, they have 12 vacancies for the job you need to have english proficiency you should have experience for seven to less than one year they don't need you to have any education or certificate or diploma for this job the special skills are you should be able to plant cultivate and irrigate crops operate and maintain farm machinery and equipment harvest crops examine crop produce and for quality to prepare them for the market you should be able to operate a tractor a fruit harvester and a farm truck you also need a work permit to work on this job. So if you do not have a, a work permit, kindly do not apply for the job because they are not going to respond to your application. The reason these companies say they are not going to respond to applications without work permit, it is because of the long process used to uh, apply for this work permit or the LMIA. The other job that you can apply for is a farm laborer by vegpro international uh, incorporation the job is 14 dollars an hour for 40 hours per week they have four vacancies and they are going to give you job for seasonal employment but if you perform well they are going to give you it permanently or to full-time employment it was posted on 26th of april 2022 so it is a recent job then the job requirements are you should have a French uh, language. So if you do not know how to speak in French, this might not be your option. You don't need any degree. You need to have seven months of experience. You should be able to harvest crops. But they need you to have a work permit for you to apply for the job. So let's look at the last job on our list today. It is a general farm worker. It was posted on 26th of uh, April 2022. By J and J Cattle Cooperative uh, Limited, it is offering the job for seventeen dollars an hour, forty hours per week. They have two vacancies, and the employer is verified. Then the job is requiring you to have English proficiency. That is, you should be able to speak in English. You should not have any certificate, diploma, or education, but you must have uh, seven months of experience. The special skills are to perform general farm duties. You operate and maintain the farm machinery and equipment. You maintain them. Uh, you should also be able to feed and tend the animals, clean and rubricate machinery and equipment, clean stables, barns, barnyards and pens, and you monitor their animals' health. It is located in a rural area and they are offering accommodation for this job. But they are saying you can apply if you are a Canadian citizen or if you are an immigrant or a foreigner but you must have a work permit for the job it's already 15 minutes as i record this video so i think it's going to be a little bit too long to to, uh, to explain how you should be going about the work permit application process so that you can qualify for these jobs so in that case i am going to record a second part for this video explaining how you should be applying for the work permit so that you can be able to qualify for these jobs that require you to have a work permit otherwise thank you so much for watching and i hope that if you apply for these jobs you are going to get employed remember these jobs they take uh, quite a long time to be hired because of the application processes but do not tire or do not lose hope because you do not know when your opportunity is going to come and it could be by applying for these jobs especially those that have 10 15, 12, 11, 4, 5 vacancies. So see you in the next video as we see how you can be able to apply and send for the work permit so that you qualify even more for the jobs available in the farms in Canada. Until next time, bye.